Hello everyone, welcome to Random Search Studio and today I bring you this new tutorial on how to uh, use the new torch I made. So let's get on it. Yeah, we have here the torch uh, you, when you, where you have it. Uh, so here you have it uh, and click for this and you drag it in your scene and then you have it. Yeah. Well, for example, uh, here you have my uh, made by so if you so if you share this with a friend uh, so they know that it's uh, i made it so have a little credit but if you start this uh, this and do, do you want this here you right click and remove so you can see it, or simply delete this stuff so yeah let's see what we have inside here inside of Touch. Well, first of all, uh, in Touch uh, we have here the user data, so we can uh, we can control it. So visible and and, and at light. So here in at light uh, looks like uh, this black, but in, then in the render it looks fine. So for example. Uh, it looks so fine. So, oh, one thing when you render, uh, if you want this glow to appear, you would go here effect. Uh, you go here to fake and uh, object glow, and you will have this kind of glow in your render. You can see now this glow, or, and then yes. So, let's keep the light so we can see it perfect and yeah well to to move the torch and the the fire continues uh, you can you may not use this okay, because it will be will not move so use this here and then we'll move it. it's called uh, the orientation so you click here for example and move it so there you have and yeah well this is the simulation for the fire and if you want the fire move uh, faster or slower here in time you put like 20 frames and it will make uh, 20 frames i think 12 it's fine it's, uh, i try a lot of time and it's fine 12 and if you want like this you keep it and if not you change and and anything else you can you have to touch so yeah. well the next thing here in you know, orientation we have the torch with uh, everything uh, the top button and light and the well this is the orientation that makes the the fire keeps there so yeah and then I have here the particles so don't touch this only use this for the orientation for move and nothing else on the here the user data so let's put here here all the express I use and all that stuff so well if we want to uh, like Steve uh, grab the torch you look for my brick where it is here you have it. oh let's do with a zombie yeah it's fine so yeah we have it here and let's uh, put the um, the torch where we want but use the orientation so that the fire always uh, move with the torch so use the orientation and let's put it in here yeah and rotate it uh, for 90 20 degrees <coughs> um, I, I like to put it like there a little bit behind and um, okay, there, there you go so well now what you have to do is go, uh, do is uh, you go here in your uh, rig and go to with this rig it, the zombie rig is mostly the same as my rig but only uh, the texture is different and something on the eyes but inside uh, here is the same so you go uh, in the bones or also with another rig 
and find the, the and in the hand of the the last bone here is normally here uh, here in the object oh, <coughs> sorry orientation and right click and we put a character type uh, constraint here PS and this clip and we drag into the target the uh, hand yeah. so now we have to move the the touch Ooh. So we rotate it uh, 90 degrees and if you want you move it like a little bit here. There it goes. Here. And now if we move here the hand it will follow. There yeah, and also the fire. Yeah, there we have it. So yeah that's the way to put the and the the torch with the Yorick. Yeah, uh, normally uh, the 12 frames of the simulation it's for uh, a normal project of 25 fps that uh, my animation are made so if you change that it uh, will be faster or lower if you put like 20 fps it will be faster and if you put 30 will, uh, um, sorry if you put 20 it will be slower and you put uh, 30 frames per se uh, for a second uh, it will be faster so we're kind of like it so yes um, well if you want like don't move or for example uh, let's go down behind go back to your place okay let's do this and yeah for moving the torch and something and all that stuff use mostly this part so because if you move the torch with this uh, the fire won't rotate so it will like follow so uh, also if you want like this so yeah like if you put the the torch in in a wall okay, you can here and rotate it Here and when we render, this thing will not show up. So we have this uh, fire. So right now we have some light. So that light. There, yeah, remember. And now it will be the fire. Yeah. Right there. See. Yeah. Hey, it's. I, I, I kind of like this this type of thoughts with with no like uh, smoke mm, it's very basic uh, and w when I make a sm uh, if you want I put uh, smoke like uh, like uh, for example what I have it here uh, uh, you put it here like all this all this smoke so please say in the comment and I will make another one with the smoke and yeah with this smoke that makes the torch in Minecraft and yeah this is my cheat uh, if you like this video thumbs up uh, subscribe and see you in the next video